Hey YouTube, it's ICU, and today I wanted to create this video to discuss a rather urgent matter in the world of jailbreaking. So today, in an unusual and certainly unexpected release, Apple issued iOS 7.0.6 for all iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch models on previous iterations of iOS 7. Currently, we're all wondering, myself and the evaders included, whether or not it's possible to jailbreak 7.0.6 using the Evasion 7 untethered utility. All iDevice owners, even those who are jailbroken, should start receiving notifications to update either via the settings app or through iTunes on a computer, which could certainly lead to a patch for the latest evasion jailbreak. Now, although it's too early to rule out 7.0.6 as a threat to jailbreakers, MuscleNerd has already tweeted words of caution surrounding the new iOS 7 update. However, the possibility of 7.0.6 being jailbreakable exists, as Apple left the vulnerabilities exploited by Evasion unpatched in their somewhat recent release of 7.0.5 for select non-US iPhone 5S and iPhone 5C models three weeks ago. And as far as the actual update itself is concerned, 7.0.6 is a relatively minor update that appears to mostly deliver a correction for SSL connection verification. Also, as stated earlier in this video, there is a chance that, like 7.0.5, the new iOS 7.0.6 update was a rush release to rectify an issue that Apple felt couldn't be left unattended until the company's forthcoming release of 7.1, which has already been confirmed to patch the evasion jailbreak because in both the fourth and fifth beta versions of 7.1, Apple patched key vulnerabilities exploited by Evasion 7 to achieve the untethered jailbreak. Now I'll have additional details on how the jailbreak is or isn't affected by iOS 7.0.6 in the days to come, but for now it would certainly be best to avoid the firmware if you wish to maintain your iDevice's jailbroken state. Also, following MuscleNerd's initial tweet where he warned users to avoid 7.0.6, he stated on Twitter that the SSL update is relatively insignificant and it's possible that 7.0.6 will be jailbreakable, in which case the evaders will issue a new un tethered evasion 7 utility so if you happen to see anything that claims it can jailbreak 7.0.6 whether it's a patch version of evasion 7 or something else entirely do not trust it again until you see something on my channel so just be sure to stay tuned for that and again for now avoid 7.0.6 because even if it doesn't patch the evasion jailbreak the official utility will not function on 7.0.6 it will only work on ios 7.0.4 and 7.0.5 for again non-us i iPhone 5S and iPhone 5C models. So if you have yet to jailbreak and you're on one of those two firmwares, just be sure to check out my untethered tutorial. I will have a link to it on the screen now via an annotation form if you're on the desktop version of YouTube. And that's it for this video. Again, just reminding you to avoid 7.0.6. And if you liked it and you want a chance to enter to win a $100 Amazon gift card, just be sure to read it up and leave a relevant comment down below in the comment section. Once your comment's been posted, you'll be automatically entered to win. And if you want to be updated more often, such as when I release new videos and jailbreak up updates, just be sure to like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. And until next time, this is ICU signing out.